my god. This thing is so disgusting to look at. Oh my god. Hey, what is going on guys? In today's video we're going to be discussing... Uh, this is, this must be the, the fastest sleeper car ever. I I, admit, I was thinking, oh, well, I want to make it get a sleeper car on Forza Horizon, so... Uh, this is what I came out with, this disgusting little rusty old bucket. Looks like a shed on wheels, not gonna lie. But the speed in this thing is insane. It's literally faster than my Lamborghini that I've got in my garage. Alright, let me just find a flat. I'm not going to show you until I find a flat. Just tapping W right now, you probably hear me spamming my W key, but... Let's find a flat. Straight, I mean not flat. Alright, this looks straight. Send it. Oh my god. This thing. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Oh, dude, 170 miles an hour. This thing's so fast. It's disgusting to look at. <laughs> Pretty sure the engine would overheat in real life in this little thing, but. Oh god. Can we reach 200? Just a question. We're in full. We're in sixth gear. Sixth gear. I think that's the max it can go to. Oh, hello, caravan. <laughs> okay. So I actually originally bought this car for only 5,000 credits, which is like nothing. But then I upgraded it for like 110k. So I actually spent like 20 times more the actual price, which is insane. Just upgrading it. I got this paint job. Just because it looks like. Looks disgusting. I want to make it. I want to make a disgusting-looking car. It's like insanely fast, like this thing. But compared to my Lamborghini, I'll get my Lamborghini. Oh, this car looks nice, though. I like the paint job on this. Oh my God, it's actually faster. No, 200. It's much faster on the VW. What about max speed? I think the max speed was 180 or 190 on the VW. Okay, we're okay. Okay, so I think the top speed on this thing is a lot higher. If we can reach 200, I don't. Yes, we probably will. Yes, okay, we reached. We, we got to 200, but this the VW is a lot faster accelerating and getting to higher speeds. But this thing, top speed is a lot faster. Okay, so the actual car is only worth 20 grand, well 20 20k credits. Just like nothing compared to what I actually spent on it, anyway. I mean, yeah, if you're looking for a really good sleeper car, this is the car you want to choose. To be honest, this thing should be black and white because <laughs> it just looks so old in the 90s. Okay, so there's my thumbnail. Easy as. So if you want to buy this thing, I think it's quite cheap just by the base car. We just, um. Let's go on to the. Wait, let's go to the festival first. Actually, no, because I'll probably go into winter. I don't want to go into winter yet. Alright, let me just go to my house. Okay, so we're at the auction market. Let's um, let's try and find the cheapest version we can get with this car. Okay, so there it is. I don't know why it's starting at that price. Because you can literally buy it new for that price. So I'm not going to... Don't bother with stuff like that. Okay, that's this one's okay. Because it's upgraded as well. So I would actually start bidding on like something this price with a high score like that. Or, I mean, you could just, you know, buy it brand new is 20k which is not that bad at all so if you're wondering how i tuned it i pretty much just um used a preset so i just bought this one i think it was like 110k so that's pretty insane so let's check the stats so it's almost 700 horsepower so i'll just run that up it's, it's very light holy crap that's probably why the acceleration is so fast okay so we're in winter now which is kind of annoying because this car's not going to perform very well Alright, let's actually see how it performs on the roads with all this ice and slipperiness. Okay, it's not straight, it's not wheel spinning or, or anything. Let's, just, let's test this turn up here. I would imagine it's going to lose control and traction of the, of the road, but let's see. Alright, here we go. I'm not going to press a handbrake or anything. Okay, it's not that bad. I thought it'd be worse. You know, this car's actually fairly good at handling, to be honest. Oh my god. <laughs> the interior is so old-fashioned and disgusting. Alright, I'm going to have to wrap this video up now, guys. I hope you have enjoyed, and uh, I'll see you in the next one.